So this may or may not be the oldest tree in San Antonio, but it's estimated to be 400 years old. What's up there? What's there? And uh, the zoo's over 100 years old, so as long as the zoo's intact, uh, this tree is protected and sheltered and it's supported. It has supports over there and over there. And as long as the zoo's in existence, this tree will probably continue. So, might make it, you know, if the good Lord doesn't come back, hopefully we'll make it another couple hundred years. But I think the good Lord's going to come back. But anyway, uh, the science of uh, tree rings is called dendrochronology. And uh, it's not an exact science, but you can glean a lot of information from dendrochronology. So, almost all trees, the first 10 years they'll have about 13 rings because of a growth spurt. Uh, the, uh, there's a man that, that makes walking sticks and he harvests them all at, <coughs> at year seven. And where there should be, you know, just one uh, tree ring per, per season because uh, as, the, as the tree starts off or because of uh, drought and then uh, rain, you can have two rings, but as a, as a rule, it's pretty accurate. So there's a there's there's a tree ring narrowing throughout the world in the uh, uh, in the 500s. It's around 526 to 536, and it's it was caused by the eruption of Krakatoa, and uh, it, Krakatoa threw out so much dust that. Uh, it caused uh, the temper the planet all across the world to drop, and when that happened, uh, at the time the uh, the the western part of the Roman Empire had already fallen, uh, and it, it already emerged as a uh, uh, you know the the reemerged as a Catholic state, but much much smaller under Constantine. But the eastern leg. And Constantinople was starting to reclaim territory. Now, after this happened, uh, it caused a whole lot of plague outbreaks because cold, wetter weather generally causes plague outbreaks. And they were recapturing territory at the time, but it, it kind of stopped them because of population loss. And it facilitated the rise of Islam. Uh, so, just that, uh, uh, there's an excellent book about it called Catastrophe. And then there was a, a, a series on it called Secrets of the Dead, where they cover catastrophe. And it's written in, in Chinese books, are talking about the yellow rain. And it was uh, volcanic ash uh, coming down in the rain. Uh, anyway, it was called Catastrophe. And the study of uh, tree rings is called dendrochronology. And you can gather a whole lot of information from it. Uh, not totally exact science, but it's it's a lot more accurate than several other methods. Uh, uh, anyway, so the rings, you know, they're they're only going to be down at, at the base would be the truest measure. So thank you. I'm out.